Hi and welcome everyone. So in today's lesson, I want to review the worksheets that I have assigned to you previously. Um, I know uh, and know you have completed it and sent it back to me and I have corrected it. But for those students who have not completed it, uh, please follow along and make sure your answers are correct. Um, most of these uh, will be um, coming on our final exam. So let's begin. Here we have the worksheet um, present simple and present continuous. Now we know uh, and now all of these could have done afhan akhadnahum and I've made videos, we did exercises, we completed our modules. This is just a review and it akad of nil ajwaba no it's correct, sah or refresh our memory. Now as we know, we know that you know the present simple um, is a tense when um, present simple talks about an action that is happening right now or when it happens regularly or um, you know which is you know this is why it's sometimes called present simple. Uh, so depending on the person, present simple tense is formed by using uh, the root word, the root form, or by adding s or es to the end. Um, how do we form the present simple? Um, in the present simple, most regular verbs use root form, except in the third person singular, which ends in s. So, for example, the first person singular, like I, um, we can say, مثلاً, I write. Second person singular, we can say, you write. Third person singular, we can say, he, she, it writes. Uh, first person plural, نحكي, we write. Second person plural, you write. Third person plural, they write. Uh, for a few verbs, the third person singular ends in ES instead of of us. Typically these are verbs uh, whose root form ends in O or CH or SH or TH or SS or GH or Z. And we know that um, the present simple in the quad in Arabic is the basit and the basit which is present simple من أفعال بي هو um, so for is لمفرد um, uh, مثل he, she, it um, Canada uh, for example and للجمع we use are um, for example زي we, you, they for للضمير I we use am we know that and المضارع البسيط um, غير الأفعال so, um, منضيف أس إلى نهاية الفعل إذا كان الفعل الذي uh, أبله مفرد. Okay? So, we know how to form the present simple. Again, present simple expresses the general truth, um, habits, permanent situations. And how do we form the present simple to be? Um, for the affirmative sentences, uh, who is subject plus am is are plus object. Um, for the negative sentences, keep me kono, um, subject plus am is are plus not plus object. And the question, how do we form it? Am is are plus subject plus object and our question mark. Men instead of question mark. For um, the present simple, you know, verbs, Subject plus verb plus object, yani masalan, I sleep. That's it. For the negative, subject plus don't or doesn't plus verb plus object. Uh, for example, he doesn't sleep. And keep me in the question, um, it starts with do or does plus subject plus verb plus object. For example, does she sleep? Question mark. So, hakena about the present simple. Now, let me review very quickly about the present continuous. Uh, the present continuous, 
um, as we know, describes something happening at the moment. يعني present simple, uh, ال present continuous, I'm sorry, بحكي عن أشياء اللي عم بتصير الوقت. يعني هلا or بتحكي عن الأشياء temporary ال الأحداث المؤقتة أو event planned in the future أو أحداث um, you know لل بالمستقبل. So how do we keep me going in present continuous? We have subject plus am is are plus verb ing plus the base form. This is for the affirmative for the positive sentences. Now, for the negative sentences, keep me kono, we have the subject, okay? We have, uh, like, for instance, number three, he, that's a subject, and then we have am, is, are, or, and then we have not. So, here we have he, is, not, and then we have watching TV at the moment. We have to add the V, ing, and then the rest of the sentence. So, how do we keep me going in present continuous? In negative form, subject plus am is are plus not plus v ing plus base form in the base sentence. Um, now, keep me going in question in the present continuous. Nibda um, with am is are. Zaid subject, zaid v ing in our question mark. Um, and in the present, we know that the present continuous in Arabic is the al-mudari' um, al-mustamir. Okay, al-mudari' al-mustamir. Um, uh, for I, we use am, like I said. For plural, we use are. For singular, we use is. Okay, um, and this is for in uh, you know we are talking about situations now. Or situations um, temporary muakkad, or um, situations that are planned in the future. Yani lal mustaqbal. In present continuous, we know um, you know nistaqdim for the present simple nistaqdim um, usually, um, and when we see usually in our sentence, we know that this is a present simple sentence, um, and al. Or in the permanent, if we see today or the day, um, this is what our sentence is in the present continuous, and uh, we know in no, you know, present continuous or muakkad, and we know um, if we see today um, or I, we use am, are, we use for the plural, we use are, singular, we use is. Um, so that's basically it. Um, let's just not forget um, the affirmative sentences. Subject plus M is R plus V I N G plus the base form. And I know we have taken all of this. This is just a quick review of the worksheets that I have assigned for you. Um, let me begin. So one, here we have in the present simple, your mom usually gets up at six o'clock. Two, do you always feel happy? This is a question. Now, you see that our question starts with do. And uh, we have um, in the present simple, like I said, the question is mumkini belshu if do or does. And number uh, four, number two, I'm sorry, starts with do. Number three, they don't watch Horror, horrors. يعني ده ما ما بحضروا أفلام مخيفة. Four. Does she visit friends? This is a question, and um, you see that we have does, and then we have our subject she, and then we have the verb visit, and you know the object friends. Five. We have I like going shopping. We have our subject. And we have our verb, I like going shopping. Um, number six, he doesn't read a book every day. He does not read a book every day. Here we are using the present simple 
in the negative sentence. He is our subject, um, does not, and then plus the verb. Now, moving down to present continuous, her dad is watching TV now. Because we see now, we are adding an ing. Like I said, present continuous, بيحكي عن أشياء لعم بتصير هلأ, and now بدل على يعني هلأ. So, we have our subject, dad, and then we have is, um, like I said, present continuous, keep me going, present continuous, subject, plus am is are, plus v, plus ing, and the base form. So we have dead as our subject, and then we have is, and then we have our, uh, you know, v watching, and um, our base watch becomes watching because it's in the present continuous, TV now. Two, are they walking the dog? This is a question in the present continuous. Like I said, in um, present continuous, كيف من كون جملة نستعمل am, is, or are. Uh, and then plus subject plus v, ing. So here I have, are they walking the dog? We have the are, we have the subject they, and then we have um, a verb, which is walk. And then we added V-I-N-G to make a present continuous. Now, number three. We aren't listening to music at the moment. We are not listening to music at the moment. So here, again, we are talking about present continuous. We have our subject, we. And then we have our, this is a negative sentence. We are using our Plus not, بتصير aren't, when we contract are and not, نحطها مع بعض, بتصير aren't. And then we have our verb, listen, and then we added ing, and then the rest of the sentence. So, هيك من كون, a present continuous um, جملة, sentence. Four, is he swimming? I'm sorry, I forgot the G in swimming. So, just pretend there is a G. Is he swimming? This is a question in the present continuous. Um, like I said, the question keep me going. The question for present continuous. Yeah, I'm using am. O is O R. Okay. So, um, for the present continuous, um, is I'm using is for singular. Okay. Is is for singular because he واحد شخص واحد. So. Is he swimming? Okay, we have a singular plus il, um, is, and then he is a singular, and then swim, um, and we added the ing. There is supposed to be a g at the end. Five, I am going to school today. Also present continuous. I, we have our subject, and um, this is a positive uh, sentence. I and then plus am, plus verb, going, and then plus the v, ing, and the base form, which is takmil uh, jumla. Now, here we have present simple or present continuous. Yani either or, you have to find out, tikhtari aw tikhtar, is it present simple or present continuous? Is it um, uh, present Present simple in Arabic. Um, present simple. I just المضارع البسيط and present continuous المضارع المستمر. One. We are reading a book now. Since we have now, now you دل على إيش present continuous like I said above. So we have our subject. We have we. We have are. We have our uh, verb, and then we have ing. Two, we sometimes read a book. Three, he isn't, he is not watching TV at the moment. Um, like I said, present continuous, بحكيان أحداث هلا, and at the, at the moment means now. It means هلا. 
So it becomes he isn't or he is not watching TV at the moment. For he doesn't watch TV on Sunday. How do we know? Because um, we have not and we have watch. So when we put that, we this is a negative sentence and it becomes he doesn't. He does not watch TV on Sunday. هو ما بحضر تلفزيون يوم الأحد. Five, I go to school every day. I go to school every day. Six, I am going to school now. Since we have now, we know we are talking about, you know, at the moment. And we know that it's our present continuous sentence. Seven, her mom always listens to music. Eight, her mom is listening to music now. Because we have now, not if in the present continuous, and we know that we have to add our subject, we have to add is, are, and um, am, is, are, and we have to add our verb, ing. Nine, this is a question. Do you do homework every day? Do you do homework every day? Ten, are you doing homework now? Are you doing homework now? Eleven, they are not or they aren't playing football at the moment. Since we have at the moment, we know this is present continuous. We have our subject. We have, um, and this is a negative statement. Since we have are not, it makes our sentence negative. So it becomes they, which is our subject, and then we have are, which, uh, I said for present continuous negative, uh, keep min kono, subject, um, zaid am is are, and then we have not, and then we have v, ing, and takmit al So it becomes um, they are you doing home, no, they aren't playing football at the moment. I'm on number 11. 12. They don't play football every day. Here, we know that it is. Um, uh, we know not to, we know to use do not because we have in parentheses not in play. So that becomes they don't play football every day. Next, we have our um, same thing, present simple and present continuous. Like I said, the present simple expresses um, general truth, habits, and permanent situations. And the present continuous um, describes something happening at the moment or temporary situations or events planned in the future. This is Mrs. White. She is a primary school teacher. She teaches English, math, and geography. At the moment, this is present continuous, she is teaching math. She lives in London and is married to George, who is French. They have, have stays the same, three children. They all love animals. We cannot say they all loves. No, love stays the same. They all love animals, but they don't have any pets because they live in an apartment. Mrs. White speaks French as well as English, but she doesn't teach it. Okay, so now depending on the sentence, we know whether it's present simple or present continuous. We have clues and we have... Um, you know, the completion of each sentence. Next, we have Mrs. White's niece, Sophie, is staying with the Whites for a few days. Sophie lives and studies in Liverpool, but she is enjoying her midterm break in London at the moment. At the moment, we did not in the present continuous. She is planning to do some serious shopping and sightseeing. 
Mrs. White's son Arnold doesn't like shopping, but he loves hanging out with friends. They usually go to the local park where they play football or basketball. However, today Arnold isn't or is not playing football or basketball. He is skateboarding. And finally, Mr. White works for a multinational company. He is not working today, however, because he is not feeling well. He phoned in sick. Okay, so here, uh, you know, we were to decide if it was present simple or present continuous. Pretty easy. Everyone, mostly everyone got this correct. Now, moving along to possessive adjectives. Um, possessive adjectives we know are my, your, his, her, it's, our, your, their. And we know that possessive adjectives, they modify the noun following it in order to show possession. Okay? Um, so, uh, possessive adjectives are often, um, they're often confused with possessive pronouns. But, um, we need to remember for the subject pronouns, home I you, he, she, it, we, you, and they. And for the possessive adjectives, um, we use my, your, his, her, it's, your, our, and their. So let's begin. One, here you have to write, write the word, write the right word on the line. The boy likes his school. Now, how do we know which word to put? We have the boy, so boy, we cannot put, we cannot say the boy likes her school. We cannot say the boy likes my school. We cannot say the boy likes its school. No. Two, Mary sees her mother every day. We know to put her because Mary Bennett. Three, my teachers, fianna us, yani akterman teacher, bring their children to our place on Saturdays. Four, the cat eats its food quickly. Now, here we used its because we don't know if the cat is a boy or a girl. So, in general, okay, we say its. Um, the cat, uh, number five, I often forget my keys. Number six, you write in your book in class. Seven, we bring our pencils to class. Eight, the men always bring their wives to the party. Now here, how do we know to put there? Because we have more than one man. Nine, Mr. Adam teaches his class in the morning. We know Mr. who was, you know, um, so we use his for Mr. She likes to give presents to her grandchildren. Um, we know to put her because we have she. Eleven, they never do their homework. How do we know to put there? Because we have they. It's in general. We are not specifying one person. Um, Twelve, uh, eleven, they never do their homework. Twelve, Ali sometimes wears his green t-shirt. Now here we have, how do we know to put his? Because we know Ali is a boy. So, you know, for male we use his. 13, we have, we love our school. Um, we is in a group in general and our for is also like in general. 14, um, Isa and Ahmed play with their sisters. Um, now, we cannot say with his because we have two, so we say their, you know, khawatum. Uh, 15, you always wear your uniform at school. You always wear your uniform at school. Um, 16, I rarely walk to my school. Yani, ana nadir no amshi 17, we eat 
hour lunch at 12 a.m. There's a mistake here. It's supposed to be our O-U-R. 18. The bird always sleeps in its nest. Since the bird is an animal, we not, we're not saying the bird is a he or a she, so we say it's. 19. She always forgets her books in the cupboard. دائماً تنسى كتبها بالدرج. 20. He often speaks to his friends. He, his. 21. They close their books. We use their because we have they. 22. Where is my book? Um, to, this is for singular, I. We say my. Where is my book? We cannot say where is I book. That غلط. So we say, where is my book? 23, here is our teacher. We cannot say, here is we teacher. غلط. So here is our teacher. 24, she goes to school with her brother. Since we have she, for she we use her. 25, they father. We cannot say they father. We say their father. Father works in a car factory. For 26, you laptop is very expensive. Yani, and I have you in parentheses. And no, I'm bamani and no, inti, a laptop tabatic inti, he radia. So, and I'm bahki, you laptop, I say your la and no, a laptop he la ilik. Wehna, I'm nekian possessive adjectives, yani, mulkia. Um, had had you know, a shit, um, you did a la ilik, oh, ilak, oh, ilo, oh, ilha, oh, ilhom. Okay, so this is what possessive adjectives, um, basically talks about. Um, we have 27. He refers to his favorite hobby is tennis. Yani, of the mohib la ilo, who is tennis. 28. I. Husband and I want to go to Paris. Ma, I, ma, but I say, I, husband, I, husband, and I want to go to Paris. No, we say, I, any, and I say, my husband and I want to go to Paris. Yani, I, you did um, me, singular, uh, but I ma say, I and my sister. No, غلط. I say. My sister and I, or I say my brother and I, or I say my friend and I. Um, 29. Layla likes her dog. Since I have she in parentheses, she did I like here. And um, she, we know to put her because we are talking about she, and she is, you know, the subject uh, pronoun. Um, like, you know, for the subject I, Mr. my. Let me continue and then I'll, I'll say it. Um, 30, it, its name is Bobby. Now here I have it. So we cannot say it name. Its name is Bobby. And mumkin nukun nahkian animal, maybe puppy, maybe um, bissa, um, you know, mish daruri shaks ta inu anakat be it. So it damen yudilala animal. ما uh, منحكي it لشخص no um, usually نستعمل it لأشياء يعني animals or things not humans um, 31 we have they and uh, we know when we use the subject they the possessive لا they possessive adjective we use there so they becomes there their names are Joseph and Jacob 32, I, umnaraf inno, the subject I, the possessive la I, here, my. So it becomes, I, teacher loves me, khata. We say, my teacher loves me, and I do love all my students. And finally, 33, we, our, we, school is very nice. Um, for the subject we, we use our. So we cannot say we school is very nice. خطأ. خطأ. Our 
school is very nice يعني مدرستنا هي حلوة منيحة ممتازة whatever um, so ما بدنا ننسى ال subject pronouns I um, ال possessive بتصير my ال subject pronoun you بتصير your ال subject pronoun he بتصير his ال subject pronoun it بتصير its ال subject pronoun we uh, possessive adjective بتصير our ال subject pronoun you becomes your ال subject pronoun they becomes possessive adjective there okay my men sell him and that's it for today's review here I have um, a little quote that Albert Einstein wrote and it says life is like riding a bicycle يعني الحياة زي عم نركب بس كذلك to keep your balance you must keep moving عشان تخلي ال I'm not sure what balance is بالعربي عشان تخلي حالك ثابتة لازم تضلك أو تضلك مستمر يعني تضلك عم تتحرك يعني تتحرك عم go forward you're moving you're progressing you're working hard um, you're surviving so again life is like riding a bicycle to keep your balance you must keep moving يعني إنه um, in general um, الحياة زي كأنه عم نركب بسكليت ولازم نضلنا you know uh, لازم نضلنا نمشي بالبسكليت ما نوقف إذا بنوقف بنخسر أو uh, بتروح علينا الحياة so you know this is فكروا فيها هاي I love it so much and it's written by you know the amazing uh, physicist Albert Einstein that I appreciate so much um, and we all know Albert Einstein um, was until today the you know the smartest person you know in the world um, so yeah life is like riding a bicycle keep your balance you must keep moving um, and that's it for today's review have a great rest of your day until our next lesson.